Imagine stepping into a remote African village where the average person towers over six feet tall, some even exceeding seven feet. A land of giants hidden from the world, yet rich in history, culture, and mystery. For centuries, scientists, historians, and explorers have been fascinated by two specific ethnic groups, the Dinka of South Sudan and the Tutsi of Rwanda and Burundi. These tribes aren't just statistically the tallest in the world, but they also challenge everything we know about human genetics, evolution, and environment. But what makes them so incredibly tall? Is it purely genetics, or is there something more fascinating happening beneath the surface? Today, we dive deep into the scientific mysteries, historical roots, and cultural traditions of these towering tribes. And by the end of this video, you'll understand why these people might continue to get even taller in the future. The Giants of Africa, who are they? Before we uncover the secrets behind their extraordinary height, let's meet the two tribes that hold this remarkable record. The Dinka of South Sudan, recognized as the tallest ethnic group in the world, the average male stands at around 6 feet 4 inches, but it's common to see individuals over 7 feet tall. The Tutsi of Rwanda and Burundi, though slightly shorter than the Dinka, the Tutsi still dominate the height spectrum, with men averaging 6 feet 2 inches. To put this into perspective, the global average male height is about 5 feet 9 inches, which means the Dinka and Tutsi people are significantly taller than most of the world's population. But how did these African tribes become so uniquely tall? Let's start with genetics. Genetics versus environment, the science behind their height. Scientists have long debated whether the tallness of these tribes is purely genetic or if their environment, diet, and way of life contribute to their extraordinary stature. 1. The Role of Genetics DNA studies have confirmed that Dinka and Tutsi people carry unique genetic markers linked to height. Research suggests they have an unusually high concentration of height-related genes, meaning that tall parents consistently pass on their height to their children. Over thousands of years, natural selection may have favored taller individuals within these tribes, leading to the towering heights seen today. Their bone growth and limb proportions are naturally structured to be longer than most ethnic groups. However, genes alone don't tell the full story. 2. The Role of Nutrition, the Secret Diet Behind Their Growth One of the most overlooked reasons behind their height is nutrition. Their traditional diet is rich in proteins, calcium, and essential nutrients that support bone growth and overall development. Milk dominates their diet. Unlike many societies where dairy is secondary, the Dinka and Tutsi consume large quantities of milk daily. High-protein foods, their diet is centered around cattle, fish, grains, and lean meats, which contribute to muscle and bone strength. Low-processed foods, they rely on natural, whole foods with minimal sugars or preservatives, allowing optimal growth conditions. The result? Healthier bodies, stronger bones, and taller individuals. But height is about more than just genes and food, their environment also plays a role. How evolution and climate shape their height. For centuries, environmental factors have played a major role in shaping human bodies. The need for heat regulation. The tall and lean structure of the Dinka and Tutsi isn't random. It's a biological adaptation to their hot climate. Taller bodies with long limbs have more surface area, allowing them to release body heat more efficiently in hot conditions. This is similar to how people in colder climates, like Eskimos or Scandinavians, have shorter, stockier builds to retain heat. Natural Selection and Tribal Leadership In many African cultures, tallness is associated with leadership, dominance, and power. Historically, taller men were often chosen as leaders, warriors, and protectors, allowing them to pass on their height to future generations. Social Preferences and Marriage In Dinka and Tutsi societies, height is seen as a symbol of beauty and strength. Taller individuals tend to have more marriage opportunities, increasing the likelihood that future generations will be even taller. So, while genetics set the foundation, diet, environment, and cultural preferences have continued to enhance their extraordinary height. Are they getting even taller? One of the most fascinating discoveries in recent years is that the Dinka and Tutsi are still growing taller. Why? 
scientists have some theories. Improved medical care, access to better health care, prenatal care, and childhood nutrition is helping new generations grow even taller. Western influence. As global diets improve, their exposure to higher calorie foods could be boosting growth rates. Athletics and physical development. Many young people from these tribes are encouraged to join sports, especially basketball, further promoting physical development. Which leads to another interesting point, their impact on the sports world. NBA and the tallest athletes from these tribes. It's no surprise that many NBA players come from African backgrounds, some directly from the Dinka and Tutsi tribes. Manuta Bull, 7 feet 7 inches, one of the tallest NBA players in history, from the Dinka tribe. Loel Deng, 6 feet 9 inches, a successful NBA player with South Sudanese Dinka roots. Yanis Antetokounmpo, 6 feet 11 inches, though born in Greece, his ancestry traces back to Nigeria, where many tall tribes exist. Could we see an even taller generation of basketball players in the future? It's very possible. But being extremely tall isn't always easy. The struggles of being extremely tall. While their height brings admiration, it also comes with challenges. Health risks. Taller individuals often experience joint problems, back pain, and circulation issues. Finding clothes and shoes. Many must rely on custom-made clothing because standard sizes don't fit. Everyday struggles. Simple things like fitting in cars, finding beds, or even walking through doorways can be difficult. Despite these obstacles, the pride in their height remains strong. The Dinka and Tutsi tribes continue to amaze the world with their extraordinary height. From their rich cultural traditions to their scientific mysteries, they stand as a unique phenomenon in human history. But here's what we want to know from you. Do you think people from these tribes will continue getting taller? Would you visit these incredible communities to experience their way of life? Let us know in the comments. If you enjoyed this deep dive into the world's tallest people, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe and hit the bell icon for more fascinating cultural discoveries. Share this video with friends who love learning about unique human traits. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one.